Hi everyone, it's, uh, Matt from Cambridge Longbows here again. I thought I'd show you something today. I've been making a another walking stick and I thought I'd show you how I do a barley twist by hand. So this isn't done with a lathe. If you were to do this on a lathe you could crack it out in a couple of minutes. But that doesn't appeal to me. I want to do things the old fashioned way by hand. So this was a squared off piece of purple heart that I rounded with a spoke shave, a flat spoke shave. So when I say flat, it's the bottom here. This is normally either curved or flat. So I always use a flat one for rounding off. So I then effectively turned this into a spoke. <clears throat> then the next stage is I get a piece of elastic. I don't know if you can see, there are some black marks on here, spiraling round. I tie the, the elastic on one end, wrap it round, fiddle it until I've got the, the gap that I want, and then mark next to the elastic in black pen all the way along for the length. Uh, then comes the fun bit. What I do then is I use a round rasp, if I can find it. Where's it gone? Here it is. I then use this to, um, I follow the line, so cutting all the way along the line. After I've done that, I then use a half round rasp. So this is a half round. This is very aggressive, this is. So then that gives you the, the hollows. What I then do is I cut a long piece of sandpaper and I get a bastard file and I lay the sandpaper across the bastard file and I then follow the grooves so you're then rounding everything off because the rasps leave very very dense grooves in there. So this is where I'm up to at the moment. So you end up with a, a spiral. I then have sanded it very carefully by hand with a 120 grit and drilled my hole in the end for an ash plug and I'm about to make the, uh, the handle for it. But this, this takes hours and hours to make, absolutely hours. This has probably taken between two or three hours. Um, so it's a real labor of love and it's probably the most rewarding thing that I make because it is just so beautiful. Well, I think it's just stunningly beautiful absolutely gorgeous. Um, the spiral on this is much tighter. I haven't done one quite as tight as this before but I think it looks significantly better than the others. And I probably only make one walking stick, maybe two walking sticks a month. Um, and it's something I do more for the sheer craftsmanship than for anything else. Um, and the people who get them absolutely adore them. So. I think I probably enjoy making these more than anything else just because it's so difficult to do. I would really encourage you, if you're into woodworking, have a go. And all you do is you just clamp it up and you clamp with soft jaws and it's all done by the quarter turn. So you, you, you do your, I do the, the round rasp all the way down first of all. So I've got the spiral. I then go on to the, onto the half round. And it's just, you rasp it, you sand it, you undo it, you quarter turn, you do it again, you quarter turn, and it takes just <laughs> forever to do. But once it's done, and once this has had a chance to go fully purple, and it's varnished, and the heads on it will be just stunning, absolutely stunning. I'll show you the finished thing when it's finished. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you with that, show you with that, share that with you today. So thanks for watching.